for now, but the very functionality, the fact that they do fall off and it all works, that's beautiful too. It certainly is. Nothing's more beautiful than science. What well, I want it to say like this. All those leaves are going to fall off. And they're going to fall off for a very good reason. I expect you'd like to know why, wouldn't you? Well, the question is, why do deciduous trees drop all of their leaves and how do they actually come loose from the stalk so they can fall onto the ground? Well, I don't know whether you're 10 or 75 years old. You might have seen this 10 or 75 times, but it's an incredible phenomenon. Very exciting and, of course, there's got to be a good reason for it. Well, you've got to think that these leaves here are tools of photosynthesis. But in the winter time, there isn't as much sun. So the best thing to do is to dump the leaf. And even if you kept it, it would get frozen and damaged and therefore not work. But how does the process actually work? How do they shed them? Well, that comes down to a thing called abscission. And between the leaf and the stalk, is a special layer of cells through which all of the tiny vessels flow from the leaf into the plant that transfer all of the water and all of those sugars. But at this time of year, this layer of cells begins to thicken up. It becomes really corky and eventually it strangles all of those tiny little tubes and it stops the flow of material. And the leaf, quite literally, dies on the end of the stalk. And as a consequence, it's able to break free and fall onto the ground. Cleverly, though, the tree then seals off the joint where it was attached so it doesn't lose any more water. Now, you might be thinking, what a desperate waste. But then think about it. All of these leaves are falling down here onto the ground. They're fragile organs. And within a very short space of time, they're going to decay, become part of this soil, break down, and then be sucked back up into this tree. It's a perfect system of recycling. Absolutely fantastic. Do you know what? It's not the whole answer. It's not the whole answer. And I've learned some more science today. I'm very excited about it. Professor Brian Ford from the Cambridge Society for the Application of Research has taught me a new word, excretophore. Shortly before they're shed, levels of potentially harmful components such as tannins, oxalates and heavy metals accumulate deliberately in the leaves. So basically, leaves shedding from the trees, that's like dumping the tree's toxic waste onto the ground. These are organs that are excretophores, and he goes on to say the trees are having their annual excretion. Brian, top work. You always have to bring everything back to poo, basically, don't you? But